So how do we price a home in today's market? Well, welcome back. It's Jeff Quinton here at thequintongroup.tv. And we're talking about a big topic right now, how to price a home correctly in today's market. And the question is, is the market going to crash? Well, experts show we think the market's not going to crash. It's a totally different market than what it was, say, in the last crash of the 06, 07, 08 market that we experienced. However, the market is correcting, okay? It, we've had this big run up for sure and a lot of demand. And right now, unfortunately, the demand has pulled back. Interest rates has risen, interest rates are rising, therefore the affordability is, is actually less, less buyer pool. So what happens when you have you know, less buyers and not at the same time have less inventory? Now, here's the thing in our market, we're seeing inventory rise. We're not seeing inventory double or triple or anything like that. We've seen an increase of, of inventory, a slight amount. So we're more inventory coming on, supply has risen or rising as we speak but not at the levels that we've ever seen. We're still at a record low amount of inventory, and yet the buyer demand has reduced as well. So how do we price a home correctly in this market? Well, two things. What a home had sold for, say, six months ago, you, unfortunately, what got that home sold six months ago was maybe you started at a list price that was lower, and you had six offers that bid it price up, right? That, compete, that was a competing offer that inflated the number. Well, today you're not gonna have those six offers. You're lucky to have two offers. And even if you get two offers, you may not even get an offer right away. You might not sit on the market for 30 days or 45 days. And so how do you price it right? Well, the number that you wanna price it at has to be below the actual list price of the original price that was listed for before, say six months ago. Meaning, example, let's say you're listed at 699. Six months ago, you had six offers on the home and sold for 750. Great. Today, don't expect to get 750. That was an inflated price, an inflated number that drove that number up with six buyers competing. Those six buyers aren't gonna show up today. So today, if you wanna get close to what it was originally at 699, right? That's the original list price without the driven up demand, you're probably gonna to have to list it less than that, say at 679, get two offers to drive your price back to 699 or maybe even at 700 or 710. Ultimately, are we gonna get back to the inflated number, right, because of the frenzy? Probably not, not in the market right now. So how do we price a home? We look at its previous list price and that is your new sales price six months ago. So anyway, that's just a strategy. Some markets are different than others, depends on the supply and demand. Any questions you might have, reach out to me direct, 609-398-5333 or email me, jeff at thequintongroup.com. As always, thanks for tuning in. Talk to you soon.